Hello everyone, it's Albert Varki here and welcome to my channel ASVXL where I teach you how to get the most out of Microsoft Excel. In this video I will share with you a pro tip on how to get the maximum from pivot tables. I should add that this tip is just one of many ways you can maximize the usefulness of pivot tables. We will be adding three extra highly informative columns to our sales revenue data. This will help us understand the data better, giving us a clearer picture of what the numbers represent. In our example, we have managers who sell to four regions and we have their grand total revenue, the money they're bringing into our company. Let's start by adding extra columns to enhance our understanding. First, drag the sales revenue field down to values again. This will create a second sum of sales revenue column. This is not what we want, so we will customize it. Right click on the new sum of sales revenue column and choose show values as. Then select percentage of grand total. This column now shows how much each number represents compared to the grand total. For example, George Smith's sales to East region represent 3.63% of the grand total. We can now see that clearly. Let's rename this column to percent of grand total to avoid confusion. Next, let's add another useful column percent of parent row total. Drag the sales revenue field down to values again, right click, choose show values as and select percentage of parent row total. This column shows the percentage share of George Smith's total sales that each region contributes. We can clearly see now that 14.78% of his sales come from the East region. Let's rename this column to percent of parent row total. Lastly, we'll add a rank column. Drag the sales revenue field to values once more, right click, choose show values as, and select rank largest to smallest, which means that the largest value will be ranked as number one. This column ranks the sales figures from highest to lowest. Let's format this column as numbers instead of currency and rename it to rank. We have now added three very informative and useful columns. These new extra columns allow us to understand sales revenue data in a very insightful and convenient way. Each number is now accompanied by useful ratios and rankings. I hope you found this video helpful. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more useful Microsoft Excel lessons. I'll see you in the next video.